25 out of 101 females who vied for assembly member positions in last year's district level elections in the central region got the nod compared to the 546 males who won despite efforts by some civil society groups to ensure full integration of women in local governance the margin remains wide lucy ayambela has more in this report Total turnout in the 2019 district level elections in the central region was 50,698 out of the 1,525,211 total voter population, representing 33.3% turnout. The United Nations Sustainable Development Goal 5 underscores the need to ensure women's full and effective participation and equal opportunities for leadership at all levels of decision-making in political, economic and public life. My checks with the Central Regional Directorate of the Electoral Commission revealed 25 of 101 females who vied for the Assembly member positions in their electoral areas in the 2019 district level elections got the nod representing 25 females compared to 546 females. In the Agona West Municipality, six females stood with 74 males for the Assembly member positions in the 2019 election. In Agona West, none of the six women that contested in the elections was able to get the nod. And in Goma Central, no female contested for the assembly member positions. The assembly has appointed three women. No person with disability contested in the central region. The Goma Central District Chief Executive, Benjamin Kojoto, says efforts were made to get a woman contest in the elections, but none showed up. I personally went out there looking for women to sponsor. We could not get one. And few that are active politically realize that most of them do not have courage to stand the insults that goes with those positions and then even the intensity of the campaign the resources that has to go into it most of them do not have that resources juliana dovi adalete contested in the agona west municipality and lost to her male counterparts the men were sharing monies to the electorate. I, for instance, did not have money to share. She says despite the intimidation, she still has not lost hope. A former assemblywoman in the Agona West municipality a secret or shared her experience. Family matters like uh, taking care of the children and others will not get enough time to do whatever you want to do. According to her, monetization of elections and discrimination against women have been major stumbling blocks to women's participation. The obstacles, one, is money. You know women, we find it difficult to get money. So, it's money problem. Though Article 36 Clause 6 of the 1992 Constitution says, the state shall take all necessary steps to ensure the full integration of women into the mainstream of economic development of Ghana, the margin of women in such leadership positions is still wide. Lucy Ayambila, TV3 News, Agunasweru, Central Region.